Hello people, in this video we want to look at breach presentation. So basically what do you mean by breach presentation? First of all, you should understand that. So basically look at this image here. Breach presentation means the presenting part is what? The podalic pole. Okay. So you can just un understand the buttocks. The podalic pole presents at the pelvic rib. Right. So what was supposed to, um, the water is going to come out first. This part is going to come out first. Right. So the this is breach presentation. Okay. How is the lie? The lie is longitudinal, right? Longitudinal lie is there. And what is presenting? The podalic pole uh, is presenting at the pelvic brim. So this is breach presentation. In fact, this is the most common malpresentation. So no wonder it has made it lot into our exams, right? Because it is the most common malpresentation. Look at this image here. So this is frank breach, the first one. Breach with extended legs. The legs are extended. The leg, leg is which part of the body? This part of the body is leg. So the leg is extended. You can see the hip is still flexed, right? Don't look at that. The leg, that is the knee. The knee joint is extended, right? So this is the frank breach. This is what frank breach. So at least let us learn these terms. There are so many types of breach. Frank breach. Okay. What is this one? Where the leg is flexed. You see here? The leg, the knee joint, it's flexed. So this is called as complete breach. Complete, complete breach. When there is flexed leg flexed breach or complete breach okay and then coming here what is the what do you observe here footling presentation what is coming out is actually uh, not the buttock it's actually the leg which is, seems to be coming out first right so this is footling presentation the presentation itself is footling then why is it under breach presentation okay so let, let us look at the varieties uh, the text that they have written here so you have the First, here they are explaining the, where is the frank breach? Frank breach, okay, this is what is the first image. So, let's look at this. Breach with extended legs is the frank breach. So, in this condition, what are you seeing? The thighs are flexed on the trunk and the legs are extended. This is what we told you. The legs are extended at the knee joints. So, this is the frank breach, right? This is the frank breach. So, breach with extended legs. Legs are extended at the knee joints. This is the frank breach, okay? This is... It is commonly present in primary gravida. In primary gravida, it's common. Anyways, don't look at all these uh, statistics. But understand that in the primary gravida, what will happen? The uterus and all will be so. Uh, what what word would you use for the uterus? It has a good tone. The uterine tone is good, right? There's a tight abdominal wall. Her abdominal muscles are quite tight, right? So that's why you won't even know they are pregnant in primary gravida, right? So uh, that is why there can be more frank breach so the baby is kind of you know compressed kind of a thing you can feel that are you understanding that is frank breach okay now let's go to the second image the second image is which one guys this one so guys focus we are looking at the second image here what is this this is the flexed legs are flexed so this is f but this is actually complete breach so here this is flexed breach or complete breach so what do you understand here the presenting part consists of two buttocks okay external genitalia and two feet so what and all is coming here, when you see the presenting part, it's not just the buttocks. The presenting part has so many things. It has two buttocks, genitalia, two feet. Everything is trying to come out at the same time. Looks like. So this is common in whom? In multi-paris women, this is common. Why is it common in multi-paris women? That they have not explained here. But understand that complete breach, flexed breach, the presenting part has so many things. Two buttocks, one genitalia, yes, that's what will be there, and two feet. This is present more in multi paris women. Okay. Did, did you understand where is frank breach more? The first one that you saw in primary gravida because they'll have tight abdominal wall and <clears throat> uterine tone will be good. So, where will you see this uh, flexed breach or complete breach? This you will see in multi paris women. Okay. Now, let's go to the last one. This is the footling presentation, right? This is the footling presentation. Yes, just understand one thing. Uh, what they told you here in the center one, this is the complete breach, right? So this is complete breach. So these two, whichever are on this side, these two are incomplete, okay? So only this one is complete. So many things coming out at the same time. That is the complete breach. Now this one is incomplete, but here the legs are extended. You can see how they have, why they have put the images in this order. See, the legs are like this. In this legs are like folded. And here it is like completely down. So that is why it's kind of a progression. That's why they have put it in this order. But actually, this is the first thing they have explained in the theory part here. 
complete flexed breach this is complete the other two are incomplete incomplete so under incomplete you have breach with extended legs this one is frank breach breach with extended legs and the last one here is the footling presentation which is also an incomplete breach so footling presentation you understood the legs are partially extended is it partially extended and the thigh is also extended that's what is more important here the thigh mainly you have to focus on that the thigh is extended that is why the entire thing is like this right so you can see the thigh the hip joint is actually extended partially everything okay now there is one more presentation called as the knee presentation that is also possible we are not going into the details so under com under complete breach you have this one complete breach or flexed breach it is called as this is complete there are three incompletes can you say frank breach frank breach frank breach okay then can you say footling presentation footling presentation yeah and one was like knee presentation knee presentation yeah these three are incomplete okay and only one is complete 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 is just called as flexed breach okay remember frank is incomplete okay there are many types of incomplete and frank is just one of them yeah you want to say something yes uh, uh, k e e is knee no. k n e e is knee yeah. k is silent okay that's why it's n e okay